Hello and happy new day. First of all, let's just congratulate yourself for showing up for your mind, body, and spirit this morning. This will be a quick 15 minute morning yoga flow for inspiration and just to get your day started. So welcome, let's forget anything that happened the day before. It's a brand new day to make the most of. Let's begin with a big inhale as the arms rise all the way up above the head, fingertips to touch. And exhale, rotate the palms down all the way to your side. Inhale, slowly reach the hands back up towards the sky. Hold the breath and exhale, release the hands down to your side. Inhale once again, bringing the arms all the way up and on the exhale, allowing the arms to float down. This time just to your shoulders and bend the elbows into Ka. Holding here, exhaling, bringing the hands together in front of you and into the heart space. Deep inhale and exhale here. And on the inhale, let's press the hands all the way up towards the sky and open up the fingertips into a beautiful lotus blossom. Exhale, release the hands down to your side. Placing the hands on the knees, inhale, round the spine back. And on the exhale, arch the back forward. Following this rhythm, Let's bring the breath all the way into the belly and exhaling out through the nose. Big cleansing breaths. Let's come back to center and rotate the head to the left and down, giving ourselves a nice neck roll here. A beautiful morning neck roll. I know sometimes the way we sleep, we can have a lot of tension built up in the shoulders and the neck. So this is our opportunity to be gentle and release any of that tension. Go ahead and rotate in the opposite direction. And inhale, come back to center, shifting the shoulders, rounding the shoulders one by one. And go ahead and extend your right leg out to the side and let's come into a side stretch. It's okay if your arms don't reach your feet. Just follow where you are in your practice. Wherever you feel that stretch, hold there and continue to breathe. This is a soothing yoga pose that stretches the neck, shoulders, back, and obliques. And on the inhale, rise back up, bring both feet back to the center, and this time let's extend our left leg out and come into a side stretch. Again, just reaching as far as you can here. Day by day with more practice comes more flexibility. Hold here, breathing into the belly. And then on the inhale, come back to center and bring both of your feet together so that the soles of your feet are connected Hold on to the toes, have a straight spine, and really try and drop the knees down to both sides. It's allowing them to be pulled down by the weight of gravity. On the next inhale, extend the feet out just a little bit in front of you. Hinging at the hips, fold forward, and see if you can bring your elbows down towards the mat in front of your shins. Hold here and breathe into the belly, exhaling and releasing, inhaling, coming back up, and let's come onto all fours. Knees are hip distance apart, and then inhale around the spine, Mother Newt, dropping the head, hold, and exhale, release into Father Geb, energetically pulling the stomach down to the mat. Inhale again, round the spine, Mother Newt, hold. And slowly exhale, dropping the belly down into Father Geb. Inhale again, activating the spine. Exhale, tuck the toes under. 
Lift the hips and press the hips back into pyramid. You can walk the feet up just a tad to really step into that pyramid. Straight line between the shoulders and the wrists. Come onto the toes and back down. And then lift the right leg high. Bend the knee. Hold here. Just opening up the hips. Extend the leg back out and drive that knee forward, bringing the foot to the mat, dropping the left knee down, straightening that leg and the back of the foot on the mat, and coming into this nice deep lunge, really pressing through the hips, opening up the hips, and then release yourself back, straight line with your right leg. Coming back into a lunge, lifting the back toe up, join both feet to the top of the mat, and come into a forward bend. Hold here and hang, just really loosening up the shoulders, allowing everything to just fall down to the mat energetically. Inhale, slowly rise the arms all the way up, and exhale, bring the hands down, and rotate the wrists as they come down. Inhale, swan dive up, and exhale again, bring the wrist down in the circular motion. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale one more time, but this time the hands come to the shoulders and bend the elbows into ka. Hold here, gazing ahead, opening up the chest. Exhale, go ahead and hinge at the hips, fold forward, come into a forward bend. Pedal the feet out and then hop or walk the feet to the back of the mat. Hold here in a tall plank. Drop the knees down to the mat, press the hips back, toes are tucked under, forehead to the mat, arms are extended, really allow yourself to stretch here. Lift the right hand high and tuck that arm underneath your body. You can bring your right ear to the mat. Hold here. Inhale, come back up. Both arms extended onto the mat. Forehead to the mat. Gazing ahead, opposite side. So this time the left arm comes under the body and left ear to the mat. Breathing here, really giving yourself that deep morning stretch, just releasing into the mat. On the inhale, slowly rise, both arms extended forehead to the mat. Take a moment here. On the next inhale, come on to all fours. Rise the hands up and bring the hands into a triangle and bring your forehead into that triangle. Really just allowing the release of any thoughts or any tension to release through that triangle and neutralize in the earth. On the next inhale, slowly rise, extend the arms out onto the mat, come into all fours, and press the hips back into pyramid. Hop or step the feet to the top of the mat, forward bend. Inhale, slowly rise the arms all the way up, and exhale, release the hands down to your side. Go ahead and twist out the body. Inhale, arms come up, exhale, swan dive down into a forward bend. Hop or walk the feet to the back of the mat, tall plank. Hold here. Inhale, press the hips back, come into pyramid. 
Lift the left leg high. Hold. Bend the knee. Hold. Exhale, drive that knee forward, foot onto the mat. Drop the right knee down and move into pressing the hips forward. Really get a great stretch here. Right in the hips, opening up the hips. Exhale, go ahead and extend the left leg, drawing the hips back. Bring the forehead down towards the knee. Come back into a lunge, tuck the back toe under, straighten the left leg, come into triangle briefly, and then hop the right foot to meet the other at the top of the mat. Forward bend. On the inhale, slowly rise up. Bring the arms above the head. And on the exhale, swan dive the arms down, hinging at the hips. Come again into a forward bend. Come up halfway, exhale again, forward bend. Hop or walk the feet to the back of the mat. Hold here in a tall plank. Release the knees down to the mat and bring yourself into a seated position, into sesh. The toes are tucked under, we're gazing forward, gazing ahead, ready for our day. Inhale, bring the arms all the way up above the head. Exhale, slowly bring the hands down into the heart space with intention, with purpose, with focus. Go ahead and extend the arms all the way back up and exhale, bring the arms down to your side. Come on to all fours and then come into a seated position. We're going to reorient ourselves so that we are prepared for boat pose. So come into the middle of the mat, bring the knees up, toes are extended, and hold here. Release yourself all the way down using your core and bring yourself into the closing meditation. You can place both hands on the heart space or place both hands beside you. Allow this to be your moment for yourself today. And if it's morning for you, setting the tone, setting the energy for much abundance, gratitude, feel good vibes, all the good stuff that you'd like to have come into your life throughout this beautiful day. I have something that I call my inspiration station and it's when I go into the vortex of my wildest dreams, my wildest imagination and I try to do this in the mornings just to set the tone for the day. So if you're up to it, I invite you to have your own inspiration station, tapping into energy to the feelings and the emotions of the highest state of your being. Visualizing what you look like, what you're wearing, what's going on, what kind of relationships and friendships and vibes that surround you. This is one of my favorite things to do to kickstart my day. So I also welcome you moving into that space during this meditation. You're more than welcome to remain here as long as you need, but if you're ready, I invite you to roll over, coming into a fetal position, taking a moment here, inhaling, coming up into a seated position, bringing the hands onto the knees, deep breath in through the nose, exhaling through the nose, and on the inhale, bringing the arms up above the head, fingertips to touch, 
bringing the hands down into the heart space. Ankunja Saneb Namaste. Thank you for joining me for this morning's practice. I hope you had a beautiful time and I hope you have a beautiful day.